it was very simple. And I don't understand why some Ghanaians don't understand. Um, we went to people who believe in our dream and our vision to literally beg them for their savings and lifetime for the earnings. And we had promised them that we'll pay them the money back plus interest on it. It was a firm. So we had two set of clients, those who provide the funds and those who needed the funds. Now, when we have taken people's monies on trust and we come to you and we listen to your problem and say, listen, I think the problem can be solved like this and we give you these people's monies and you walk away with it. I think the least you should expect these uh, borrowers to do is if something should go wrong, they should come back or call you and to discuss the issue. But it is quite annoying and disrespectful to say the least. When after you've done that and it's time for them to pay, they just don't bother. And we have to now find time to go and look for them. You think it's cultural? It is cultural in a way. Um, some people walk into offices to take a loan knowing that they, they don't want to pay. Why? It's some people think, oh, any money with available one and what has we go and take it and chop it. Because when they take the money, you'll be surprised the kind of thing they do with some of them. They probably buy a new car, marry a new woman, or build a house, or go for funeral. Or oh, if the uncle dies or somebody dies, then, then forget the money is gone. And they go and you see them in big cloth with chains and things that with women following them. And it's your money that they use it for that. You sometimes see clients. Well, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, how do you do? No, no, no. If you are owing at the time, I'll confront you then. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. The One client came to me. I couldn't find. When my mother died, stupidly enough, he came there because he thought that was when I was at the weakest point. And he was greeting. I saw him coming. So I got up and said, Cut out of this bullshit. You know, you owe it. You stay here. Are you of course. Your mother's funeral. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're going to see your mother's He was owing me. You know, I'm going to see you. You are. <laughs> you know. Yeah, so, um, we had to put some discipline in that. Interestingly enough, some of my clients said I discipline them when it comes to money and money. Their business. 